apologies for the, the delay, customary uh, testing from about six different agencies. So, um, over to the floor for questions for AJ and Derek James. I think they want to talk into there when you speak. Um, to them. They don't want to right talk to AJ, They don't want to. <laughs> you ended this fight with a big right hand. Obviously, that's Wilder's signature punch. Were you trying to send a message that you can trade right hands? You can match right hands with Wilder? No, at all. Right, Wilder's got a good right hand. I've got a good right hand, but both complete separate fighters. Um, I was just following coach's game plan to the best of my capability. Uh, obviously, when did we uh, draft Hellenius in? Monday. Monday, so yeah, switch of opponent, um, switch of game plan, and I just followed it as best as I could and got the victory in the seventh round. Did that game plan take longer to unfold than you had hoped? Not really, one step at a time. Remember, it's, it's competitive boxing. Everything I do, my opponent's trying to shut down every advance I try and make and vice versa. So, yeah, it just took seven rounds. If I could have done it earlier, I would have, but it's a breaking down job. You know, many ways to skin a cat, and uh, I've done it in the end. So, yeah, we're here now. And what emotion took you out of the ring after the fight? Just spend time with the fans. It's what's important. Um, people that have come out to, to witness heavyweight boxing. Some people like um, they're massive fans and supporters of the sport and myself, so I just thought let me go and spend some time with them for a minute. I think that's, I always believe that's important and it's not the first time I've done it. I've spent time with fans many a time, so yeah, it's just what's in my, in my heart. Can you tell us, um, we saw you chatting to Hellenius afterwards, were you able to share this what you had to say until the end? The modern day boxing is different, but in my opinion you should never give up. You said you're very talented and uh, you could cause a lot of people some problems. So um, stay, continue, credit to you, and um, you know, I appreciate you for, set, for helping save this show because, as I said, that's why I went out to the supporters because it, it means a lot for me to box tonight. Hellenius played his part as well, so I just gave him a pat on the back. Even though he wasn't successful in the ring, he's, he's a massive success in uh, saving this event. AJ, were you happy with the performance? Uh, it's up to my coach. I don't really rate my performances, whatever coach thinks. But we can go back to the drawing board. Um, and I know there's a lot of things we can improve on. And I felt better than I did in April. That's, that's the main thing. But I'm not going to rate my opponents. I'll leave that to coach and the team. How much did the crowd get to you tonight, do you think? Not necessarily. I think they don't understand. As I said, it's, like it's competitive boxing. We're trying to shut each other's advances down. Um, and I spoke to what, uh, Maurice about that. It was like, ah, oh, it didn't look as exciting. I was watching certain fights tonight, and um, I was like, ah, oh, they don't look as exciting as I thought they would. And he was like, no, it's not that they don't look exciting. It's a game of chess. When you're playing, it's interesting. It's a thinking man sport. And from the outside, chess is a boring game. But everything I try to do, they're trying to shut down. And why am I going to go in there and trade like, and from round one? Break them down. How did they feel when they were booing you though? Were they booing me or, Hel or Hellenius? <laughs> That's the question, right? <laughs> Who were they booing? Well, I think they were, people expected it to be an earlier knockout than what it was, but you got the knockout as well at that. Uh, have any of them ever boxed before? You tell me. That's, that's what I wonder, right? Was there anything that Hellenius did in there or the, how the fight went that would help prepare you for Wilder? I don't, I don't know, no. Well, I don't know, that's what I say. Everyone's different. Every opponent's different. Um, no, not at all. But the rounds, the rounds, the experience, ring, ring activity's been good. Thank God. So that's, that's the main thing. We're getting back on track. To be fair, credit to Matron Boxing, um, World Class Boxing, 258 Management. They set out a plan early on this year that I'm going to get busy again and stay active. And uh, we're fulfilling that prophecy. So whatever you want in life, guys, set out your dreams, speak into existence, and we're fulfilling our prophecy. So roll on what's next. That's the main thing I got out of competing, is uh, getting that like, ring rust off my back.